Ohio! Thank you, let's go. I just finished my Japanese class for today and we did kimonos and all that stuff. And um, I wore the kimono that they had. It's the kimono I wore is mostly just for the um, this is this kimono I'm wearing. Uh, I'm gonna talk about the other one first. Okay, the other one I got. Well, it's not my kimono. She had a whole set of kimonos that she bought on her own, like on eBay or something. And um, so what happened? She got her kimonos, and they're all for like different occasions. She even had a wedding kimono that is like thousands of dollars. What um. The kimono I wore was like for celebration, for parties, for wacko parties, like rock stuff and all that. Oh, ow. And all that crap. And um, so, and some of them were just for like going out and having fun and all that stuff. So, yes, and I'm wearing my kimono, the one that I got. Those weren't the ones that she had, were not mine. I'm going to be bringing mine tomorrow. This is my kimono. Yes, I know it's a strange color to you people, but deal with it. So, um, I have a golden blue OB, because it's like one of those origami sheets. They have like two-sided. Some of the origami sheets like don't have two sides, but some of them do. Same with the OBs. Well, yeah, some OBs have like only one side. One o Some OBs were just like you tie the OBs, and they, weren't, and they aren't really OBs and everything like that, but mine is a real OB. And my bow is like really messed up because I did it myself and I can't do bows very well with OBs because there are huge strips. They're like this big and it's impossible to do a regular beautiful tie, a kimono dress tie uh, around the waist. And you would have to wear three things around your waist. And you had to wear something under this kimono, but I don't have that piece yet, so... And I don't, neither do I have the shoes or the socks. But I got most of the stuff. I don't have one of the pieces out of the three pieces. The first piece that comes with the kimono, then you gotta get an obi, and this, the thing in between the obi and that stuff. And so, yeah. Um, I'll show you. Let's see the obi. Yeah! Obi! Wee. Look at my awful socks. Okay, um, yeah, but sometimes if the obi's a little bit too long for you, you have to bump it up like I had to do, but it, it's not really that big. It just goes up to my feet, and that's pretty much it. But it's still pretty big, if you know what I mean, but, um, I just, like, bumped it up a little bit because I didn't want it to be me. So, yeah. I'm wearing my epic kimono. It's just... Well, this is more of like a spring. They're kind of like, some of them are like cherry blossoms. Um, it's yeah, it's spring. It's a spring outfit. But um, for me, since it's my only kimono, I get to wear all I want because I don't see that much of Japanese people here anyway. So I get to wear it all I want, people. I could wear it in the house. People wear their kimonos everywhere. Not to bed. Not to take showers and like wear them as robes. They're outfits. Dress out outfits. Dress up outfits to go out, to go everywhere. They're not made for as bath robes or any of that crap. It's made for. If you do that, that's kind of messing up and making fun of their culture, and that's very mean. My mom tried to do that, and I was like, lady, you just insulted them. That was very rude, but you know, whatever. Got Obi and everything, and I'm having so much fun with this, so please. I love Japanese stuff, so if you, if you do too, you should have a kimono, because they're beautiful. And try and get a kimono that doesn't have a real Obi. <laughs> you, know, you should get a real Obi, just like, it's really hard to tie and like crap. Um, so yeah, and oh my god, it got undone. This is exactly what I mean. It's bull crap. Okay, so anyway. See you guys later, and thanks for watching. Oh yeah, Sakura from Vision Inside Paranoia. Sorry, I was just too carried away with my kimono and everything. Because I was so happy wearing the kimonos, and 
Oh yes, and the shorter these are, well, this for this is kind of short of a kimono. Uh, it means that I'm married, and I did not realize that till a couple of days ago, I, I, till yesterday, actually not till t today, till today I didn't realize that the shorter this is, well, this is the shortest one ever, this short, and this means I'm married, and the medium sized ones I go a little bit longer, and. That's for whenever you're married or not married. Um, the really long ones, like the ones that go up to your feet, these things that go up to your, like, down over there to the feet, um, show that you're not married, you're just a kid or something. I'm married. I'm not a kid. I'm married. Look how short this is. I'm I'm a married girl. So, for those of you, I'm married to Andy, so hello. <laughs> you dare take away Andy from me. So, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys later. Sakura from Vision Side Paranoia. I'll see you later. Sakura, out.